I'm Beth. I'm the lead nurse for paediatric palliative care and bereavement support. A warm welcome to you all from Bristol Royal Hospital for Children. We would like to thank you for taking the time today to join us in our service of light. We hold this service to honour and remember the lives of the children who have been cared for here at the Children's Hospital. Children who have brought love and happiness to the lives of their families and friends. Children who have brought joy and inspiration to all the staff here. We recognise that this time of year can be special and significant for many, but when a precious child has died, we are aware it can often be a difficult and poignant time. It, for some, it may be a time where emotions and a sense of loss feels heightened. For some, it can be a time where memories and connections are more prominent. Parents, siblings, grandparents, family and friends, we wish to share with you how you are all very much in our thoughts. Our hope is that this service will bring us together and provide you with a sense of support while remembering those who are not with us, but very much loved. Hello, I'm Neil Chaplin at the Bristol Children's Hospital. Our annual service of light allows both families and staff to acknowledge the light and the darkness of the year behind us. In our service, we will place stars on a tree, stars shining in the night, symbolizing a hope that remains within us and the grace and beauty of those whom we love and will forever carry in our hearts. Each star touching us deeply as together we remember and perhaps pray. All around us in our homes and our communities are lights and tinsel and candles. Our hope is that this service would also bring light, a light that shines wherever the darkness we have is experienced. Our prayer is that it will not just be sorrow that unites us, but peace. Star in the Jar by Sam Hay. My little brother likes looking for treasure. Tickly treasure. Glittery treasure. Even trash can treasure. But one day he found something extra special. So special I thought it must belong to someone else. We asked the helpful girl from school, but she said it wasn't hers. We showed us the lunch lady, 
but it wasn't hers either. We asked the sheriff, but he shook his head. The fairies hadn't lost it, nor the wizards. If no one has lost it, my little brother said, that means I can keep it. My little brother loved his new treasure. He put it in a jar and carried it everywhere. As the day turned into night, the little treasure got shinier, but it didn't look happy. Then my little brother spotted something. Up high in the dark, dark sky, there was a message. Lost one small star. It's here, my little brother shouted to the sky, but the little star's friends were too far away to hear. We had to help the star get back home. We tried climbing up high, teaching it to fly, and bouncing the star back up to the sky. But nothing worked. Maybe the little star would have to stay in the jar forever. Then, an idea popped into my head. I raced inside and looked in every cabinet and every drawer. I found flashlights and twinkling lights, book lamps and bike lights, glow sticks and headlamps. And we sent a message back. Then the, star, then the sky began to crackle and fizz. And the stars joined together and came a long, swirling, whirling, sparkly silver chain all the way down to our backyard. And they lifted the little friend gently back up to the sky. My little brother felt sad. He lost his special treasure. But then, thank you friend, he realized he hadn't lost his treasure. He made a friend. A forever friend who would twinkle him to sleep every night. Good night, Star. reading from the Gospel of St Luke, chapter 2. Now in that same region, there were shepherds living in the fields, keeping watch over their flock by night. Then an angel of the Lord stood before them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid, for see, I am bringing you good news of great joy for all the people. To you is born this day in the city of David a Saviour, who is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign for you, you will find a child wrapped in bands of cloth and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of heavenly host praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest heaven and on earth peace among those whom he favours. When the angels had left them and gone into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let us go now to Bethlehem to see this thing that has taken place, which the Lord has made known to us. So they went with haste and found Mary and Joseph and the child lying in a manger. Whilst you watch this service, we hope that you'll feel our love and support as you remember the boy or girl who is treasured to you. We feel privileged to have cared for every precious child who's been in our care. They've touched our lives too, and each child has left their own special lasting impact on us. We'll always remember them. So now we want to take this moment to pause and 
honour their lives and the joy that they brought. And if you have your own candle at home or wherever you're watching, perhaps you'd like to light yours as we light ours so that we feel connected in, at this special time. Know that we are holding you in our thoughts and prayers and wanting you to get a sense of peace and comfort as we reflect and remember children so special, so loved, and so much missed. Even gentle candlelight powerfully overcomes darkness. The glowing flame represents the child who lit up your world and the enduring love that shines brightly at Christmas time and always. Sometimes, when the sun goes down, it seems it will never rise again, but it will. Sometimes, when you feel alone, it seems your heart will break in two, but it won't. And sometimes, it seems it's hardly worth carrying on, but it is. For sometimes, when the sun goes down, it seems it will never rise again, but it does. Bless this light. Bless us in our tears and in our laughter. Bless us in our hope and in our remembering. Bless this light. Bless us with wisdom and comfort. Bless us with kindness and friendship. Bless this light. Bless us with joy and with healing. Bless us with peace and with love. darkest of nights, there is the light of love that never goes out. Always, on the chilliest of days, there is the warmth of memories that will never grow cold. Always, in the loneliness of times, there are others who share in our loss, our grief and our remembering. And always, there are those we deeply love, no longer physically with us, yet part of our stories our memories and our lives. Love never dies. We are never alone.
Celtic blessing, deep peace of the running wave to you, deep peace of the flowing air to you, deep peace of the quiet earth to you, deep peace of the shining stars to you, deep peace of the gentle night to you. Moon and stars pour their healing light upon you. The deep peace of God, the light of the world, to you and to those you love. 